You must go and see Avatar The Way of Water. The movie is spectacular, action-packed, emotional, entertaining and technologically in its own league. No movie fan should miss seeing this movie in cinema. I'm not spoiling the story or any highlights. James Cameron delivers with his soon-to-be biggest surprise hit. From the start of the movie, Cameron wastes no time to pull us back into Pandora and sets up the stakes for his protagonists. Escape, settling in and fight determine the movie's three acts. Each act holds nearly unreal viewing pleasure for the audience. I've watched the movie in 3D and high frame rate and it was worth every cent. Instead of spoiling the movie for you, let me say that I'm a long time Cameron fan. I love all of his movies following Piranha 2, but the 2009 released Avatar I had only seen in cinema back then. I liked the technology but found the movie a bit shallow. Therefore I never felt excitement for the new Avatar movies James Cameron has been preparing over recent years. When talking with other Cameron fans our common opinion was, who wants to see that? Why is Cameron not making a movie we could all look forward to? Then the first pictures of the movie were released and I was wondering why anyone should want to see a pure CGI movie which looks like a computer game again. And then the first trailer hit and I and my Cameron fan friends all shook our heads regretting that this time old Jim will unfortunately fail. The movie may earn some bucks but it appears out of time, out of touch. And I had seen enough of Cameron presenting underwater stuff and blue people. But as a loyal Cameron fan, I found myself reading first impressions of the movie. And what got me thinking was, when critics claimed the movie's narrative was simple and it leaned very much on family and parenthood. Oh James Cameron, you old fox. The movie is a hit in the face for everyone, claiming movies should be made for a modern audience. I'm absolutely sure that Cameron has noticed what trends and content have been spreading through movies in recent years. And with Avatar The Way of Water, James Cameron delivers his point of view, what the audience wants to see. I had not seen this coming. Technologically, The Way of Water is totally ahead of anything else ever seen on screen. But this time, it is first and foremost the story which keeps the audience captivated. The movie theater I had watched The Way of Water was filled with families. There was continuous silence throughout the more than three hours runtime. The audience was struck in awe what they were seeing. And when the final act came over them, one could feel the tension and clenched fists in the room. That is the impact this movie has on its viewers. It commands the room. Avatar The Way of Water is the must-see movie of 2022. I thought Top Gun Maverick would keep the crown until end of the year. Until now. Word of mouth for Avatar The Way of Water will break its way like a tsunami and make this the most successful movie of 2022. Congratulations James Cameron, you have done it again.